What is up, YouTube? What is going on? Welcome back to the channel. Today it is the day, the official 200th video for Breaking Vintage Cards. And uh, it's been a long time in the works here. Uh, a little bit of a gap because I've been trying to figure out some technological stuff and figuring out that I am just having a hard time. So I decided to uh, take one of my videos that I was going to play later on and upload it with this and just put a little intro in here and get you rolling on to video 200. But before we do that, I did want to say thank you to everybody who has been supporting the channel, who's been helping us out growing. Uh, I think we're up to like 185, 180 subscribers right now, which, you know, that's awesome. We're on our way to 500, which is where we want to be. And, uh, you know, ultimately beyond 500 to 1,000 and, and many, many more. Uh, sports world with, uh, with sports cards these days has been going crazy. You know, uh, PSA taking over other grading companies and uh you know tops is missing that and the other thing and and it's just all crazy right well at break of vintage cards we continue to strive to bring you the greatest stuff that's out there and uh old and new and we'll continue to do that we appreciate all your support appreciate you helping out again growing the channel longtime subscribers new subscribers the biggest thing you can do is like share and uh, also subscribe if you're not a subscriber. So that's going to do it for this little intro. Let's get into the video and we'll talk to you soon. Breaking Vintage Cards is bringing you 2023 Chronicles Mega Box Edition. 48 cards where you can find one autograph or a memorabilia card. There are a variety of prospects and legends from more than 20 iconic brands. There's your odds. Pause if you like. And we are going to look for the obsidian carolina blue parallel in there eight cards per pack six packs per box um what can i tell you about this i think in the grand scheme of things as a um unlicensed product for baseball i do like chronicles i like chronicles in football in baseball you've seen us open it before um it's not bad you get a mixture of the uh the old guys and the new guys um, you know, just unfortunately, you know, Panini does not own that baseball, um, rights there. So the box is empty, Steve. We are going to get rolling with our packs of 2023 Chronicles. Now, this box right here on sale at my local card shop, 30 bucks. Okay. So 30 bucks for eight, well, eight cards per pack but uh, for one autograph. So basically you'd say you're paying for the autograph, right? You know, for 30 bucks, not a bad deal. So we're gonna jump right into it and see well, some of these great 20 brands that Panini has to offer. Hope everyone is doing well, enjoying the content and enjoying the channel. Click like, subscribe, comment down below and tell us what you think about these bad boys. Trevor Hoffman, Gabriel Gonzalez, some of the classics. Andrew Taylor, we have Chase Midroth, Owen White on the Rookie, how about Larry Doby on the Luminance, let's see what we have behind here, we're going to have Ivan Rodriguez on the Obsidian, and Trevor Hoffman right behind there, okay, so that is pack number one, you can see the variety of different card styles that uh, Chronicles will give you. If you have the chance to pick it up for, you know, 25, 30 bucks, it's not a bad deal. Again, it's unlicensed. So, you know, you're just getting the name. You're not getting, uh, you know, you can get an autograph, obviously, but you're not going to get, um, you know, in a game uniform or anything like that. So Jack Leiter right there. We have Tony Gwynn, the Hawk, Andre Dawson, Mel Ott, we also have back here, we have Jordan Lawler, and we have Dennis Eckersley on the Recon. All right, so two packs down. We are going to keep it rolling with pack number three. Uh, again, it said like and subscribe. You know, um, hit the notification button so you know when the next video is coming out. Uh, leave a comment down below. Sharing is caring. How about a subscription if you're not a subscriber? You get to see more of Hack Wilson. He's a good one, huh? Max Muncy, Everson Piera. Looks like we are going to have a Joe Morgan. 
and Lou Bordreau. How about a Jimmy Rollins? And right behind there, we have Tim Salmon, or Tim Salmon, however you'd like to say it, and Jackson Merrill for San Diego. So still looking for that autograph or memorabilia card. And uh, I think for the price, you're going to get some okay cards. You're not going to probably hit a home run here. Again, it's not going to be, uh, you know, any one-of-ones or anything like that. You're going to get yourself some nice-looking different cards. Carson Williams, Dan McCabe, and how... <laughs> Just when I say you may not get, how about an Ellie De La Cruz on the Rated Rookie? Clearly, that is going to be probably our box hit right there. Very nice. Ellie hopefully is going to continue to have himself a great year this coming up year. Um, he started off hot and then just kind of fizzled out a little, as uh, most prospects sometimes do. So we are down to the last two packs. We have now Joey Weimer. There's Jackson Merrill again. How about uh, Jackson Holiday on the Luminance? All right, that's a nice one right there. Got Yvonne Melendez, Harmon Killebrew. On the back side, we have Zach Geloff on the season ticket. I think that's going to be a. Okay, pretty cool. And right behind there, Kumar Rocker. There he is in the XR. So we are down to our last pack right here. Last pack magic for us. Maybe we got it. Maybe we don't. We shall see. Here we go. Bobby Witt Jr. signed that big contract in the offseason. He's ready to rock and roll. Espino. Will Rudy. And who we have here, Joe DiMaggio. We have Cool Papa Bell. Who wouldn't want a Cool Papa Bell? Let's see, we'll go from the back. We have a Dale Murphy from Atlanta on the certified right there. We are going to have ourselves a Robin Ventura on the Zenith. And it looks like we're going to have ourselves a memorabilia card right behind Cool Papa Bell. Let's take a look. Who do we have here? GSSTM. Ty Madden for Detroit, and there it is, Ty Madden. All right, well, that is going to do it. This is gold standard, by the way, so I would say that the Ellie De La Cruz probably is going to be our, our big hitter out of there. But uh, you can leave a comment down below and tell us what you think about the box. Uh, again, for $25, $30, bucks, not, not a bad investment. Uh, you get a little bit of everything in there, and, uh, you know, nice-looking cards. That's going to do it for this video, folks. I appreciate you watching. Continue to support us and uh, subscribing. If you are a current subscriber, thank you. If you're just stopping by for the first time, consider a subscription. It's free. And, you know, we just do this. Open up some cards and see what we get. And you make a decision on what you think and if it's something you'd run out to the card store and get. That is going to do it. Thank you so much, everyone. Thanks for watching. Thank you for your support. Until next time, my friends. We appreciate you, and we'll see you soon. Take care now. All right, so there you have it. That is the Chronicles for 2023. Hope you enjoyed the video number 200. Again, moving forward, I don't think we're going to number them as episodes anymore. I think we're just going to call them videos and just put them out, and uh, you know, we're going to roll out our shorts with a lot of the vintage stuff. The only reason we don't do a lot of the vintage boxes, uh, you know, during the the regular videos like this is because well frankly they come with 32 to 36 packs with 15 cards in each unless you have a rocking chair and uh, a warm cup of cocoa you're going to be there for a while so we're just going to try and keep them short keep them sweet and simple we'll get those vintage cards out there and every once in a while we will have a special break with the vintage cards in a full-length video so Comments down below if you think of anything else that you'd like to see on the channel. We appreciate you as always. Thanks again for watching. And until next time, take care.